Well, that's quite the, the light that we have there. Anyway, <laughs> Faith Pocatello Daily here. It's the 4th of October, 2022. And we're just going to continue this idea of God as our maker and a maker of heaven and earth. Psalm 95, verse 6. O come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before the Lord, our maker. And this is just something that I want us to get uh, across, this point, this idea, that, that when we recognize that God is our maker, it really causes us to have a sense of humility and a sense of worship. And, and we cannot worship unless we are bow low. And so this idea of bowing before we give him our worship and praise, we give him our lives. And then kneeling is this sign of allegiance to a king. I give you my allegiance. And again, when we recognize that we have a maker, then we realize that that maker has authority over our lives. Not only does that maker know us better than and we even know ourselves, but that maker has the ability to change things, to recreate things, to um, destroy things. And we don't like to think about that when we talk about God, but he does. He is the maker of us. He has the ability to do what he wants. Now he loves us and he desires us to know our maker, but we really know him when we realize he is our maker and we worship and we bow down and we kneel. We pledge our allegiance to him. So today, let's just kind of look at that. How can we worship God in everything that we're doing? How can we find ourselves in a place of humbleness? And then how do we see ourselves kneeling in allegiance to our God and King? So may God richly bless your day. Enjoy Jesus. Go and share life.